In this problem, we're told the diameters of the main rotor and tail rotor of a single engine helicopter are 7.6 meters and 1.02 meters respectively. The respective rotational speeds are 450 revolutions per minute and 4,138 revolutions per minute. Calculate the speeds of the tips of both rotors. Compare the speeds with the speed of sound, which is 343 meters per second. So the speed of sound, I'm just going to call it VS, right, is just four, or 343 meters per second. And so what we're going to be doing is comparing these speeds to this, right? So the first thing we have to do is find these speeds. So how do we plan on doing that? So the formula you needed to know is velocity, right, which is basically the speed, is equal to r omega. So something rotating like this, and I know they're, they don't look like this. I just drew them as circles so they're easier to imagine. But basically the velocity is just its radius multiplied by its angular velocity. Right, so we're given um, this information, right? So we're given the diameter. So if we want to find the radius, we just got to divide them by two. And then we're also given omega, right? Or the angular velocity. But this needs to be in radians per second, and this is in meters, right? So these are in meters, but uh, we need to make sure this is in radians per second. So first thing we got to do is just let's divide these by two to get the radius. So if you divide it by two, 7.6 divided by two is just 3.8 meters, right? So that's going to be the radius. And then for this one, it's just going to be uh, point right the radius is just 0.51 meters so now we've got the radius now what we got to do is find omega but we need it in radians per second so let's then convert them so 450 revolutions for every minute right we know that if we put one minute on top right we know there's 60 seconds on the bottom because there's one minute for every 60 seconds that'll cancel out the minutes now we have revolutions per second and then we want to get rid of revolutions and put it in radians so one revolution is the same as two pi radians so that'll can cancel out the revolutions, and then we now have radians per second. So you just want to do uh, 450, and then divide by 60, and then multiply by 2 pi, essentially. And when you do that, you're going to get 47.12 47 47 I'm just going to say 47.124, and then this is going to be radians per second. So this is going to be this one, right? So this is the main. Now let's do this one, right? We're going to turn this one into the correct unit. So 4138 revolutions per minute. And we know that there is one minute for every 60 seconds, right? We're just doing the same conversion as the last one. Two pi radians for every one rev. So just do 4138, divide by 60, then multiply that by two pi. And when you do that, you get 433.33. So 433.33 radians per second. Now we've got the correct uh, angular velocity, so we can just plug in. So let's start with the main. So for the main, the velocity is going to be equal to its radius, which is 3.8, 3.8 meters, multiplying by its angular velocity, which is 47.124. So this is main. So if you go ahead and do this, 3.8 times 47.124 you'll get 179.0712, right? So it's just about 179, and then it's going to be meters per second, right? Because this is in meters, this is in radians per second, but basically radians is unitless, so you just imagine this going away, and then it's just meters over seconds, right? So 179 meters per second, this is main, so I'll just call it VM. So that's that, right? It's going to be the speed of the main rotor, now let's do the other one. So V equals this radius, 0.51, multiplied by its speed, 433.33. So we'll go ahead and do that, 0.51 times 433.33. You'll get 200. You'll get V, and then I'm going to call this VT for the velocity of the tail, is 220.9983. So we'll just say about VT is equal to about... 221 so and then this is in meters per second so now we've got the velocity of both right this is the main this is the tail and so comparing it to the speed of sound which is 343 meters per second we know that both of them are going to be substantially slower right so the tails uh about 100 120 off but yeah so these are going to be your answers and then it's just less than this right but yeah so these are your answers and hopefully you found this useful